A laugh a day keeps the doctor away. Oh, well, that's what I'm going to say anyway. So today we're going to check out Peter Shamowski and see if he can give us that laugh we desperately need. If you enjoy the video, hit that like button down below and also subscribe. I don't know if you guys know this. I don't know if the girls know this, but I'm a little bit of a flirt. Mm, are you? I'm, uh, I like to... Very, uh, not, it's not nice that you laughed at that, but... Uh, <laughs> True, I, I think we all are. I think every, every person likes to flirt a little bit. I mean, we all like sex without strings attached, apart from puppets. Puppets don't like it. I'm great at flirting. You know who's not great at flirting? Germans. I think yeah. it's very difficult to flirt with German people. Any, any Germans in the house? Yeah, exactly. That's my point. They're never here. Do you know what I mean? No. I'm, I'm, glad, there's no, I'm glad there's no Germans in a basement in Warsaw anymore. Um, <laughs> so, no, sorry. That's, that's, that's Too soon. Too soon. It's been like 70 years. Like it's, <laughs> I think we can laugh at this stage, right? It's not like, too soon, Peter. No. <laughs> always you get that and the sooner people can laugh about things the better it was the same with things like 9-11 wasn't it uh with 9-11 and obviously the london bombings and all those different things the sooner you can laugh and joke about it the better because you're not letting it defeat you and all that and and yeah you don't want any germans in warsaw basements though do you they're all dead um, <laughs> <laughs> look what i'm saying <laughs> What I'm saying is just difficult to flirt with them. I think, no. I think, like I was flirting with this German chick the other day and I asked her the question, I asked the question, if you could describe your perfect man in one word, what word would you use? And she just looks at me and says, competent. <laughs> I'm like, that is the most German answer I have ever heard. Like, what do you, what, competent and punctual. I'm like, what? <laughs> saying woman and I told this story I told this story to another German girl I was flirting with and I was like hey check out this German chick I met I'm and she's like oh that's hilarious and I was like I know I'm a comedian and then <laughs> he made up the joke and, goes, and then I asked her the question I said oh, well if that's a stupid you know answer how would you describe your perfect man in one word and she just looks at me and says not Jewish. <laughs> I'm like, that's, well, that's fucking two words. two words. I was offended. I was like, that is... Obviously, it was a joke. It was joking, right? It was a joke. Yeah. It's, you know, like the swastika was a little bit too much, but it was a joke. Oh. <laughs> Look, it's dangerous to flirt is what I'm saying. <laughs> you never know who you're going to flirt with. That's not true. You do know who you're going to flirt with, right? That's, that's a... Whatever. Um, I was never good at flirting. Oh. I was never good at it. Never had the ability to do it. One time a girl came up to me. She came up to me. She knew my comedy. And she came up to me. In the first sentence, the first sentence she came up to me. She was like, do you want to come back to mine, play Xbox, and have sex? <laughs> to which I replied, what games do you have? <laughs> Oh, brilliant. Oh, fantastic. Do you know, I, I love, I love that he can take the mick out of what he knows, out of history that was awful. Some of the best comedians can do that. They can, they can really take the piss out of some awful history. And it works. It's not offending anyone, is it? People laugh because they know the realities of it and you've got to play to that sometimes, you know, he jokes about Germans in a bloody Warsaw basement. Now, clearly at the time it was horrific, but now it's laughable, right? It is laughable. And that was so far. Uh, he's so far. He's, I think he is one. Well, I'm going to make this statement. He is my favorite Polish comedian. However, I haven't actually seen many Polish comedians. So it is basically a list of two. It's him. And then there was, kitty cat lady i can't remember her full name now but he is my number one at the moment very very funny keeps 
uh, all the best humor is relatable and and people can relate to it look i'm english i have no idea about um germans in in polish basements really except from what i've known but that's something that people especially people from europe and whatnot can easily understand and find humor in you know a lot of people know about the germans being quite uptight and you know when he's saying about them not being very flirty well actually Germans are probably seen that harsh language, for example, that, that, you know, the accents they've got is very harsh and, and they come across as quite serious and you're taking the piss out of that. That's absolutely fantastic. He's so funny. Well, I hope you had that laugh you needed. Thank you so much for watching. If you've got any more recommendations, please, if they're Polish in the Polish accent, that's cool. Absolutely fine. But make sure they have Polish, um, English subtitles so I can actually understand what they're saying. That's a good help. Thank you so much. Like, subscribe, and I will catch you next time.